Today, we're here announcing a fourth grant gift to the University of Louisville from the Leona M. and Harry B. Helmsley Charitable Trust. The Helmsley uh, Charitable Trust, over a period of time, has visited with us at the University of Louisville with our faculty, with our researchers, with uh, the people who really do amazing things at this university. There are kids that are walking because of Andrea Behrman's work. Uh, and it's absolutely amazing. If you haven't been uh, up to that floor in Fraser and you do have a chance to go, I assure you, you will walk away with tears in your eyes. Uh, so thank you for believing in, in us uh, and our programs here. Uh, but I want to further say that uh, we couldn't be doing what we're doing without this sort of public-private partnership. Uh, it's absolutely critical to us. Uh, where NIH funding has diminished over the years, uh, philanthropic support is incredibly important uh, to us. And a program like this isn't something that you can write an NIH grant about and have uh, three different uh, programmatic goals. Uh, it's clinical care at the cutting edge of clinical and translational research. This project, I don't know if you're familiar with it, but you should, uh, this project has the possibility of being as transformative as I can possibly define that word for the most vulnerable among us, children and our grandchildren, uh, which is important to us. Uh, through the use of locomotive, locomotive training, uh, Dr. Berman and her team are giving families great hope. Hope that even in the face of catastrophic injury, a child can receive truly remarkable treatment. We now know that the spinal cord, much like the brain, is smart and can respond, learn, and once again send signals to produce movements. Children born with spinal tumors or injured before one year of age who never rolled over or sat up or stood or took their first steps, now even several years after injury, are achieving these abilities, these firsts of development through locomotor training activity-based therapies that activate the nervous system below the level of the injury. Amy Smith is mother of one of our patients. Emily is her daughter. She suffered a severe spinal cord injury at three months of age. Upon her arrival to our program, Amy described her daughter, then three years old, as not going anywhere that she did not take her or put her. Even breathing was work for her daughter. After participating in our locomotor training activity-based program, Amy commented, I never thought that with such a severely injured daughter that I would need to childproof my home. This year, Emily is so active that Amy and her husband Bryce had to childproof their home for Emily's safety.